so much for clicking on this video. I'm Aaliyah and so right now I'm on my way to drop the kids off at school then I have to rush and get to work. Yeah, so I just want to come say hey. I don't have any lip gloss on my lips. I need to find it and then it makes sense. But um, yeah, I'm dropping the kids off at school and then I'm going to head to work and get ready so we can get on the bus and go to school. So make sure you like this video. If you like this video, subscribe if you haven't already and also comment down below. Let me know how you're doing. And I'll see you. Good morning. So we wait to <laughs> Come on, let's go. It's rainy time. Come on, let's go Hello. so we can get into school, y'all. It's rainy time. <laughs> Hello, it's school time. Hello, it's home time. Hello. <laughs> all right, my client is all packed up. I have his suction machine, his backpack, his lunchbox. I have my water, my bag, and actually the bus is pulling in right now. So I'm about to go ahead and turn the TV off, lock the door, and we're going to be out. All right, so it is lunchtime. I just finished giving him his food. I just finished washing my hands and flushed him and all that. We're in the cafeteria with all the kids, so it's loud. So I just want to come in, pretty much check in, y'all. Um, I'm going to go back out there, wait, and till it's time to go. And I'll see y'all later. And I tell her all the time, don't let him tell you he doesn't like all right, so we're back at the house now, out of school. I'm just in here chilling. It's about 3.10 or so. I'm gonna get him up and feed him around four. Uh, right now we're watching Hotel Transylvania, or, well, it's really watching us. But I'm gonna go ahead and change him at four and then put him up for his feeding. And I'm about to start on my nursing notes for the day so that I can leave on time. What can I get for you? Hello, do you have any um, bacon? Yeah, we do the bacon, man. Can I get two orders of your bacon and bacon? Yes, please. Anything else for you? Can I get a small um, cookie butter? Cold brew cold brew, okay? Yes. Would that be all? Yes. You can put the one. Thank you. Just a drink. It actually tastes good, so hopefully it don't mess my stomach up. Alright, so I got off of work and let me turn this light on. I got off of work and I stopped by my apartment because one of my friends sent me something, so I went and picked it up. Um, and then I was hungry. I haven't eaten for a while. I ate at uh, my client's school because I forgot my food in the fridge earlier. But I ate at my client's school, but I didn't eat too, too much of it. So I got hungry. I stopped and got me some snack and bacon from Dunkin' and a drink. I want to try this cookie butter. I'm gonna mix it with my one of my protein shakes when I get home. But I'm going to run in here real quick, get some things that I need for now, and then go home and drop the stuff off. And I have to go and do some hair, and I have to be there at 645. Right now, it's 526, so I may be a little late. I don't know, but um, just a retwist on lock. So let's go ahead and go in the store real quick and see what we can grab. People have been buying this stuff out, and I don't blame them. It's already bag two bags and then got some juices on there for the kids. I'm gonna film a haul for y'all, but just a glimpse of what I got up in here for almost three hundred dollars. I think it was three hundred or two eighty five, something like that. But my vehicle is so freaking beautiful to me. Like I just love looking at it and i think it's more of a oh my gosh you did it and you did it by yourself kind of thing like i'm proud of myself and it's like this is just a, a symbol of what i can do but i have a lot of groceries here i didn't I only had eight bags i probably could have got used nine but this is all i got but anyway um let me put these bags up and then i'll be back all right y'all so it is 6 20 i have to be there to do her at 6 45 so I'm going to stop and drop these groceries off real quick and then put the frozen stuff up and all that good stuff. And I'm going to head and do some hair. I'm leaving rulers right now. Y'all, I just used, so I get food stamps, but this is my last month getting food stamps. And I thought that I would feel some type of way when I actually made it to that point of it being the last time I get food stamps. But I just can't help but to be happy and proud and you know proud because 
and not knocking anybody that gets food stamps or anything i got them for a while since i had my girls but to be able to be classified as making too much money to get help from the government basically is kind of a blessing that means i'm doing something and take these out that means I'm doing something. And I know that some people, it's like, dang, food stamps. Like, I need to have food stamps. I wish I had food stamps and stuff. I'll probably get there at some point. Maybe next month when I actually start really paying out of pocket or the month after that, whenever. But I'm just so thankful because I am who I am. I'm thankful for every struggle that I've had. I'm thankful for every trial, every tribulation, every downfall. Um, because I was able to learn a lesson from it. I was able to push myself and just keep going. And now here I am. I'm in a season of being, you know, a pre Appreciating myself and being so proud of myself um since my move a lot of people have told me you are not giving yourself enough credit you're too hard on yourself and all that so when i sat down and i started reflecting and stuff you are doing really well from where you came from now you could do better and all that good stuff i get all that but from where you came from to where you are now like i'm doing so much better than i ever thought that i would be doing yeah 27 second divorce all that good stuff but i gained my independence i've gained my peace I'm finding myself. I'm learning myself so much more. And I'm so thankful for that. If it wasn't for like the struggling, it was times we didn't have food growing up. It was times we didn't have water growing up. It was times I didn't have clothes growing up. My hair wasn't done. Um, you know, it was so much stuff that was going on and things that I couldn't control. And now that I'm in control, I'm thankful that God allowed me to keep my right frame of mind and stay focused on the things that I needed you know, and I had my times, I still have my times where I just, but whatever, I'm a splurge, I'll get it back next check. I'm trying to get myself out of that um, when it comes to shopping and stuff like that. But, you know, I'm just thankful because I could be so much worse than I currently am. And I'm so thankful that I am who I am. Um, like I said, times get hard, y'all. Times get hard. Um, but we have to think about where we came from, where we are. We have to reflect. Like I always say, we have to kind of think about our minds and strengthen our minds strengthen ourselves um look at the brighter side like the times that we didn't have food growing up it was a lot of times i didn't i didn't have food um i was making mayo sandwiches and i was making toast with uh honey on it and stuff like that i was in a deep freezer i wanted ice i wanted some water um because the water was off and i was in there scraping the ice off the side of the deep freezer like y'all like when i say things got things were crazy things were so um i was scraping ice off the side of the deep freeze on the inside or whatever it was they said it wasn't good for you but shoot when you're thirsty and stuff you do what you got to do in a glass and i was just drinking that and like eating that and it was kind of satisfying um and i can still taste it now talking about it but you know, i've been through some things i've had some struggles but me being in that situation made me who i am today i'm able to make different kinds of meals i can cook i can cook expensive meals i can cook with the you know expensive meats and stuff like that and if we're struggling a little bit i can make you happy with a meal that costs about ten dollars like you know i can i can play both roles and i'm thankful for that and i don't throw it in people's faces i can help people when they say okay well I only got this but i need to do this okay well let's like i bet you we can figure it out and you you may have a dollar left or something like that so i'm thankful for that um anyway that's enough for that but i just want to come in this video because i actually have to go so make sure you like this video if you like this video subscribe if you haven't and also comment down below let me know how you're doing and i promise i'll see you on the next one